Good morning. It is 6 a.m. Donald and I are going to the gym together this morning. <sighs> it's Tuesday. We're gonna have a great day. And we're gonna be working some legs today at the gym. Full lower body workout. So, got my coffee in hand. I put a little soy milk in it and a little bit of this. This oat, oat milk cookie creamer by Silk. So good. You only need a dash, it's so sweet. to onboard a new client how fun is that and Dallin's getting ready for work I spaced filming most of my workout today because the gym was very busy we went early and I feel like it's the you know the rush of the crowd that goes before work so when that happens I usually go into you know autopilot just trying to get m the machines I need but I did film some of it for you guys if you want to see more I post more workouts on Instagram as well but we're gonna get this rolling here I have to call her in 30 minutes so I'm just prepping myself and then I need to make breakfast I made some breakfast which before the gym I did have coffee with soy milk and I also had a small glass of orange juice just because I was feeling like it I've been really liking orange juice lately but this is a very random meal we got just egg with fresh jalapeno and microgreens strawberries and then this was from a dish i made last night which has zucchini pasta sauce the rayo brand and seitan just mixed in together so kind of random but delicious my call went very well if you're new here and you don't know i do women's fitness and nutrition online coaching so that's what i was doing this morning getting a new client signed up and i only take on so many at a time because i want to have more undivided attention for each person so I have three spots left. If you're interested, you can read about it on my website and apply. I'll link it down below. But anyway, I'm gonna eat my breakfast and then get ready for the day. Oh, trying to decide what to do today. I have a few things I could do. I still am working on this behavior change course. I talked about it in my last video. Still gotta do that, but I have till the end of the year to finish it. I only have one chapter left in the book I'm reading right now. So I'll go over that with you guys. Maybe I'll finish it today. I kind of want to go shopping because I need to pick up some new makeup and I'm itching for new activewear. <laughs> I haven't bought activewear in months, like two months probably, which is record breaking for me. But I think it's because I swapped over to books. Books are cheaper though. Okay, makeup is done. I just went and grabbed the mail. I ordered contacts for Halloween to go with my costume. If you know me, I love wearing contacts to be extra spooky. Those are the contacts, you can see them. They're like a yellow gold. They almost look kind of orange though, which is fine. So yay. And then I also got a new sweater that is kind of October-y, but also I think I can wear it year round. I mean, Halloween Town is completely october and I'm still gonna wear it year round. I got it off of Amazon. Okay, so you can pick any color and then it's a skeleton on it. I'll show you. Oh, it's cute. Okay, so it's brown and then it's got the skeleton on it drinking coffee. So me. So I'm gonna wear that today. I think I got it oversized. It feels like it's gonna be pretty big. I'm gonna link it below too. They had it in like orange, pink, black, white. You could get it any color. But let's get dressed. 
Okay, we're dressed. This top isn't the best quality, like it's just printed on there. See this? Ideally, it would be like sewn in part of the shirt, but we'll have to see how it holds up when I wash it and dry it. I don't know. Okay, let's get a full fit check. Jeans I just got, they're actually second hand. Got them at the thrift store. They're really long, so I have to roll them up. But kind of cute. Light wash, love that. And then I got my chunky vans on. And then of course I put a top on under here in case it gets way too hot in this big sweater. My mount that I use for my camera in here will not stay on the windshield. And I don't want my camera to break. So I don't know why. I don't know why it won't stay on. So I can't really vlog while we're driving, but we're gonna go to Sephora first. I never buy makeup, but I wanna buy contour. I've been just like contouring my nose for fun, but I use like a powder eyeshadow. So I kinda wanna get a real contour that I can like, you know, do my whole face with just for fun. And then my sister was able to squeeze me in for a trim on my hair today. Last time we did it, we had to bleach it again. So I just have a lot of breakage and we didn't, we ran out of time before her next appointment so we weren't able to trim it. So I'm kind of overdue. Like I should probably cut off like a good three, maybe four inches. But I've been listening to podcasts as I usually do. Spooky ones. Everybody's doing like spooky stories right now, which I love. I love a good spooky story. But I was kind of feeling like maybe I've been listening to too many and getting spooked. Because last night I woke up at night a couple times worried I was going to be, ha be having sleep paralysis, which I didn't. But just have been hearing the stories about them. It's been freaking me out. <laughs> I'm like, Ellie, you maybe need to take a break. So maybe we'll listen to a different podcast today. I just love scary stories and I love scary movies though. Okay, let's go to Sephora. Okay, not a good spot to do a little haul. This right here is fine. Okay, speaking of the contour, I went into Sephora and I had no idea what I was looking for. I just needed cream contour. So I said, can you help me find cream contour? She said, what brand? I said, I don't even know. I just need help. So she told me her favorite was the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. So how fun is that? So I got, she color matched me on my hand, which I literally didn't even know which one to get. I think I got the middle one. This one's way too dark, I think. I don't know a ton about makeup. I'm just winging it. So I figured I would try this. If I don't like it, then next time I'll try something different. Uh, Lululemon was right next door. Very tempted to go in there, but who do I think I am? It's not Christmas. Like, what was I gonna get, you know? So we didn't do that. On to the next. Update. So I went into the thrift store, Uptown Cheapskate. I didn't know if it'd be a bust or not, so I didn't film it. But I found one pair of leggings. Probably took a little too long to find one pair. These gray, Alpha Elite leggings, okay, 10 bucks. And they're in pretty great condition. Thrifting really does take some work and I'm not always up for it. And I was really, those are probably like the last leggings I found. I was losing my steam. And then I tried them all on and only liked those ones, so. My hair appointment is in less than an hour now. So I think I'm just going to go grab a coffee and kill some time until I have to go to my hair appointment. And we... That's my podcast. later Dallin's home from work and I scarfed down a seitan seitan burrito that I just made because I was really hungry I put seitan vegan sour cream 
mixed greens, beets on it, lemon juice, green dragon sauce on a tortilla. It's actually really good. I ate it faster than I should have, but that's okay. And I have a friend's birthday dinner tonight. So exciting. So I'm gonna abandon Dallin here. What are you gonna do, Omga? Cartoons. Watch cartoons? Dallin's just gotta decompress after work. <laughs> and before I go, I'm gonna hang out Dallin and finish the book. I got two pages left. Oh, speaking of, I ordered a copy of It Starts With Us by Colleen Hoover. I pre-ordered it like seven months ago, and it's going to get here tonight. So I hope you readers out there that watch my channel, you Colleen Hoover lovers, I hope you got your hands on a copy, and we'll read it together. Okay, shh, I, had, I need to read. Okay, we had to get ready quick, but dress the jeans up with these snake booties. Not real snake, don't worry. And this see-through sweater with a color bra underneath. Good enough. Good enough, right, Al? Right. Hi, guys. So it's the next day. I forgot to film any of the dinner last night, but I did get some photos and such. You know, sometimes it's good that I forget to film because I'm just hanging being present, but it'd be better if I could just get a few shots. Having some coffee this morning. Before I close out this video, I want to do a little unboxing because guess what just got here? Well, I got here late last night, but I haven't opened it yet. Here we go. <laughs> I hope it lives up to the first one. I really liked the first one. Can't wait. Ah, so excited. Okay, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, little vlog. Do all the YouTube stuff, like, subscribe, really support my channel. Um, let me know any videos you want to see next, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. You in the backyard of your old farm.